Today, here on GarageBand and Beyond, we're gonna be running a little bit of an experiment, something that I've always wanted to do. Have you ever been curious, what is the big tonal difference between light strings and medium strings? Now, of course, there's gonna be a feel difference. The way the strings feel under your fingers, the light strings are always gonna be a little bit easier. But you hear it all the time. Medium strings are better for tone. This goes for electric or acoustic. Today, I'm just doing it on acoustic. I am gonna be using the Martin Retro Strings, Full disclosure, this is not a sponsored video. Um, but yeah, I, I have this guitar and this has brand new light gauge retro strings on it. And I have a set of mediums that I uh, wanna put on here and see what the big difference is, okay? So I'm gonna just start playing now and then I'm gonna go away, change the strings, come back and play some more and we will all have a better sense of what the big tonal difference is. Here we go. It's funny, I've actually always wanted to time myself. <laughs> Changing guitar strings, that they came in a little bit under 10 minutes, I'm impressed. All right, so um, I can already tell you there's a tonal difference. So uh, I'm just gonna start playing. Okay, so um, this guitar definitely likes medium strings better. Um, interesting. Yeah, I'll tell you this. Uh, definitely what's happening under my hands, big difference, right? Um, which is to be expected for sure, but uh, you know, I'm a heavy handed player and I do have lights on my D28 and my HD28 and those, I, I don't know, they sound great with lights. They work really well. This guitar, the DSS 17 Black Smoke, um, 
It sounds better with mediums on it. it, and it feels a little bit better too. Like I'm a heavy handed player, so when I come down hard, I don't feel them flop around nearly as much as the light strings. These are the retro strings from Martin Guitars, and I've been really, really digging these strings on acoustics lately. I don't normally put nickel strings on my guitars, um, but the, sort of the more traditional vintage retro guitar strings were made out of nickel before they were bronze and phosphor bronze. They were nickel strings, which are now now more traditionally used for electric guitars, um, but they make this proprietary blend of nickel for the Martin Guitar Company, and, and it works. They, they really work nicely on acoustic guitar. If you've never put nickel strings on your guitar, check out these retro strings. They're totally cool. I really, really like them. They just sound different, and different's good to me right now for acoustic guitar sounds. Um, I just like it better. Definitely more low end. The high end has a little bit, it, it's just tighter. I don't know how to describe it. It's not as thin, you know, not as tinny. But yeah, more low end and, you know, acoustic guitars, that's always gonna be better. Um, I think on this particular guitar, I'm gonna keep mediums on it now. And I kind of regret making the review with lights on there because that's what I was familiar with. That's what I'm used to having on my guitars. Also, the guitars that I was comparing this one to in that particular review all had light strings on it. So I wanted to make sure that at least the gauges were the same so it didn't you know, seem like I was cheating or anything. But um, in general, I think uh, medium strings on this particular guitar, again, unsponsored video. I'm doing this all on my own for my own entertainment. <laughs> I hope that this answers the big question, what is the difference between light strings and medium strings? Feel under your hands and tone. The medium strings are gonna have more low end, um, a, a lot more actually in the mid punch, I will say, there's a lot more in the mid punch, and then it's not as bright, um, not as like thin, tinny bright, I will say. I liked the light strings and I was sort of, you know, sad. They were brand new and I had to pull them off the guitar. I don't like taking off new strings, that's no fun. But medium strings on this guitar in particular for sure, and I might even start experimenting with my other two Martins because uh, that might be an interesting thing to do. Anyway, you guys, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this one, and um, I'll talk to you very soon, all right? Peace and love.